What's up everybody, Adam here. Now we all know how important sound is in gaming. And if you play as much as we do, you know you're gonna want a comfortable headset that you can wear all day. The sound quality should be epic and immersive and your call should be heard crystal clear the first time. So we set out to build a headset that completely dominates while gaming at home, on the go, or at the highest tournament level. Designed to last forever and to feel great the entire time. And that's probably my favorite thing about Void Pro is just how comfortable they are. These plush microfiber mesh fabric and memory foam ear cups are extremely breathable and feel lighter than air. Supporting the ultra soft ear cups is Void's proven design. Built with the highest grade materials such as metal cantilevered yokes and premium PA6 glass fiber infused plastics. Inside we've packed 50 millimeter custom tune drivers which produce immersive Dolby 7.1 surround sound. And to top it all off, let's talk about the microphone. Our engineering team nailed it. The Void Pro features a unidirectional microphone that reduces ambient noise for enhanced voice quality. We've put the microphone sound quality through vigorous testing to make sure it passed official Discord certification with flying colors. Void Pro works seamlessly with Q2 to bring you a ton of additional features. For example, you can fine tune EQ profiles to adapt to your game, or if you want some visual customization, Void Pro syncs across all your Corsair devices with Q. Void Pro comes in several different models. Void Pro USB, Void Pro Surround, which is compatible for mobile and console gaming, and Void Pro Wireless, which boasts a 40 foot range and up to 16 hours of battery life. If you want to find out more information, head on over to Corsair.com. Today we'll be setting up our Arctis 7 gaming headset. First, let's take a look at what comes in the box. The Arctis 7 comes with a micro USB charging cable, a wireless transmitter, and the mobile cable. To set up your Arctis 7 for PC or Mac, you'll need the wireless transmitter. First, you'll connect your wireless transmitter into your PC or Mac. If you want to connect your Arctis 7 to your PlayStation 4, connect your wireless transmitter into your console. To power your headset on, press and hold the power button for at least 3 seconds. You'll hear a tone and the power button will illuminate. If you want to connect your headset to your mobile phone or Xbox, simply use the 4-pole 3.5mm extension cable. Your Arctis 7 already comes paired to your transmitter, but if you need to pair it again, press and hold the transmitter pairing button for 5 seconds until the LED begins blinking rapidly. With the headset off, press and hold the power button for 6 seconds. Next, you'll want to be sure engine is installed and updated. If you need to charge your Arctis 7, simply use the micro USB charging cable by plugging it into your headset and your PC. To mute your mic, simply press the button. If the mute button is out, it is muted. To change your volume, scroll the dial on the left ear cup to adjust. 